Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to our video update for today on the latest achievements in China's infrastructure and technological advancement. In this episode, we will cover a range of remarkable mega projects that highlight China's commitment to innovation and development with the application of the country's super engineering skills and capabilities. But before that, be sure to subscribe and smash the notification bell for you not to miss our latest updates. Alright, let's get started. China's large high-altitude air shower observatory, an expansive cosmic ray observatory situated 4,410 meters above sea level in Daocheng County, Sichuan Province, has successfully completed national acceptance procedures on May 10, as announced by the Chinese Academy of Sciences. Spanning an area of 1.36 square kilometers, this new technology represents a significant national scientific and technological asset for China. Its primary purpose is to study cosmic rays at high altitudes. This achievement solidifies China's large high-altitude air shower observatory status as a vital component within the country's scientific endeavors, positioning it as a crucial hub for uncovering the mysteries of the universe and advancing our understanding of cosmic phenomena. China has recently finished constructing a massive offshore oil and gas drilling platform weighing a staggering 12,000 tons. Serving as the central platform for China's Guizhong 19-6 gas field, this gas field stands out as the first substantial and fully integrated 100 billion cubic meter gas reserve in eastern China. It boasts proven geological reserves of over 200 billion cubic meters of natural gas. The platform itself measures 32 meters in height, 65 meters in length, and 56 meters in width. Once operational, it is anticipated to deliver a steady and dependable supply of clean energy and chemical products to the Beijing Tianjin Hebei region, contributing to the region's sustainability efforts. As part of China's ongoing construction of the new Western Land Sea Corridor, the Pinglu Canal stands out as a significant endeavor. Notably, it will showcase the world's most extensive inland water-conserving shiplock, demonstrating China's commitment to pioneering advancements in high-efficiency water transportation systems. The construction of this remarkable canal aligns with the country's ambitious goals of enhancing water conveyance capabilities while minimizing wastage. By incorporating cutting-edge technology and innovative designs, China aims to optimize the efficiency of its water infrastructure and create a sustainable and resource-conscious transport network. In the city of Jingmen, located in Hubei province in central China, an extraordinary event unfolded. Two colossal bridge girders showcased a flawless demonstration of synchronized rotation and air docking. This remarkable occurrence marks the first-ever simultaneous rotation of two immensely significant bridges in China. The precision and coordination displayed during this event highlight China's engineering prowess and technological advancements in bridge construction. By achieving perfect synchronization, these bridges exemplify the nation's commitment to pushing the boundaries of infrastructure innovation. This milestone serves as a testament to China's dedication to developing cutting-edge engineering solutions that not only facilitate efficient transportation but also showcase its engineering capabilities to the world. The Hongqiman Grand Bridge, situated in Guangdong Province in southern China, has successfully completed its final connection, bringing the two ends of the bridge together.
With a length exceeding 1,100 meters, this suspension bridge serves as a vital link between Guangzhou and Zhangshan. Its completion is poised to greatly improve connectivity and drive socioeconomic growth in the Greater Bay Area encompassing Guangdong, Hong Kong, and Macau. By facilitating smoother transportation and enhancing accessibility, the Hongkiman Grand Bridge plays a significant role in fostering regional development and integration. China has introduced its inaugural commercial SkyTrain, which incorporates several cutting-edge technologies and provides passengers with a remarkable 270-degree panoramic view through a sunroof installed on the floor. The train has been specifically designed for a section of a tourism sightseeing route situated within the Optics Valley Central Ecological Corridor in Wuhan, spanning an impressive length of 26.7 kilometers. In its initial phase, the project covers 10.5 kilometers and features six stations along the route. This innovative transportation system not only showcases China's technological advancements but also aims to enhance the tourism experience by offering passengers breathtaking views of the surrounding landscape. The Hongkiman Bridge in China has achieved a significant milestone by successfully closing the remaining gap, connecting the cities of Guangzhou and Zhongshan in Guangdong province. This bridge is a crucial component of the broader Nanchi Zhongshan Expressway project, which aims to enhance connectivity among key cities within the Greater Bay Area. The completion of the project, anticipated by 2024, will greatly facilitate seamless transportation and promote the interconnectivity of the region's core cities. China shipbuilding Dalian has successfully delivered the world's inaugural M350 type floating production, storage, and offloading FPSO, vessel which represents a significant achievement. This vessel stands as the world's first ultra-large offshore project meticulously crafted with cutting-edge specifications. Its design allows for versatile utilization in oil and gas development operations across various international waters. This landmark delivery highlights China's independent capabilities in designing and constructing advanced maritime infrastructure. By introducing this state-of-the-art FPSO vessel, China solidifies its position as a prominent player in the global offshore industry, contributing to the advancement of oil and gas exploration and extraction operations worldwide. China's Inping 20-4 offshore drilling and production platform, weighing 15,000 tons, has been successfully installed onto the pre-constructed underwater base in the Pearl River estuary. Achieving this feat required precise docking of the platform with a 100-meter high jacket on the seabed, located approximately 200 kilometers southwest of Shenzhen City in southern China. Operated by China National Offshore Oil Corporation, this immense project demands exceptional accuracy in navigating the unpredictable sea surface. And that's the end of our story for today. 
I hope you like this video. Thanks for watching and see you next time.